Well, Peter, do you know what? The forecast was not good. It was perfectly dry until about 10 minutes ago, and now the heavens have opened. But Barton Bike Night is a huge pull around here, and judging by the numbers of crowds I can see around me, it certainly doesn't seem to have put anyone off. The organisers' fears don't seem to have been confirmed just yet. And it's not just the motorbike enthusiasts who love this event, is it? Well, Peter, no, it's not just your hairy biker cliche that you're going to see in Barton tonight. I have to say, people, young and old, absolutely love this event, and they come from far and wide to enjoy it. Now, of course, one of the big draws this year is this man, Steve Plater, who's fresh from winning the TT. Steve, thanks for joining us this evening. Hey, you're very welcome. Steve, you have just won the TT. I mean, how are you feeling about that? Fantastic, you know, it's... Um, I went to the TT for the first time last year for the Centenary and uh, had a very successful year and learned an awful lot and decided to go back and with a long-term plan of winning one over the next few years and it sort of uh, came, came to the forefront and managed to win it much sooner than I actually thought. You're quite a celebrity in these parts tonight. I mean, how does it feel to be here at the bike night? No good, it's so busy, I really, I can't believe it. You know, I, know, I know Barton's the biggest bike night of, of, of the season, really, of the summer season, so uh, you know, there's plenty of people here and everybody's interested in the same thing and it's a good atmosphere. Steve, thank you for talking to us. Now, he may be the man of the moment, but back in the 70s and 80s, it was Mick Grant here that everyone was talking about. He won the TT seven times. Mick, these were the bikes that you used to race on. That's right, yes, certainly in the, in the late 70s, um, I rode these in the TT for about four years running and um, had quite a few wins on them, yeah. A lot of people excited to be to see you here tonight, how do you feel to be here? I think it's fantastic because the one lovely thing about motorcycling is that no matter how many people you get, they're always well behaved and maybe high spirited but it's a wonderful atmosphere and it's just lovely to be here, a part of it. Mick, thank you for talking to us. A great night here in Barton. Thousands of people arriving, all here to enjoy the bikes. Peter.